Yeah, what's going on guys? Pineapple Square. Today we're going to be talking about all of the known bugs in Suicide Squad Kill the Justice League. Now, before I, you know, start on this video, please consider liking and subscribing. And I'm not making this video to necessarily make fun of Rocksteady. Um, I'm really just making this video to help because if, you know, people are watching it and maybe a dev or a community manager is watching this video, can help them maybe lead to issues or fix issues and problems. And, you know, if someone's watching this video who doesn't know about these glitches, you know, it might help them in the long run. Starting, we're going to go through three different categories. We have major bugs, minor bugs, and our last category of do they even know it's glitched. Um, starting with major bugs, we have long loading times. Um, I don't know if you guys have been playing the game here recently, but there has just been an insane spike in long loading times. Specifically on the just a sec loading screen, it takes about five to ten minutes and I was gonna show a footage of it but I just didn't really want to you guys know exactly what I'm talking about but I will say though this bug seemed to have been fixed because the loading screens today as of today as of March 11th have been a lot faster they're about 30 seconds compared to the five minutes um, next though we have multiplayer not working at all Multiplayer does not work for me and a lot of other players, and I see it all the time being talked about in the Discord. Multiplayer is seemingly unplayable, and with this game being a big part, you know, being live service and four-player co-op and having that feature being completely unplayable, it is a big downside. Um, next, we have the game freezing on loading screen. This is specifically on the Just Sex screen. The game will freeze and basically you'll just be sitting in an infinite loading loop and next is people being unable to log in I haven't had issues with this but I still see people complaining about how they're unable to log in and basically feel like they've wasted $100 um, next is unable to progress in mastery basically you would just be stuck and frozen on your current mastery level and it wouldn't let you progress in the missions um, I believe this has been fixed this has been fixed for me and I haven't seen many people talking about it but um, I haven't seen them mention it in the patch notes so I'm just gonna bring it up um, next is this is specifically for multiplayer sessions when you're doing killing time um, and is unbearable lag past mastery level 45 um, if basically if you've been trying to you know if you play trios or squads or duos and you're doing killing time unlimited you know what you'll know what I mean the lag is unbearable it is practically unplayable and it seemingly only happens past master level 45 now and I haven't tested it since um, the burn affliction nerf but if someone you know wants to drop down in the comment section is the is the lag still bad past master level 45 on killing time um, next is no gold skins for reaching mastery level 100 now this is only if you're in a multiplayer session if you reach mastery level 100 by yourself you will receive the gold skins and a quick alternative for this is just to contact WB support um, I was able to get my gold skins by contacting them and the next major bug before we move on to the minor bugs category is the Riddler achievements are glitched um, some people have had their trophies glitched and the riddles glitched um, some people have had both I'm in the case of both my riddles and Rid Riddler trophies are glitched um, They've at least addressed it though, so I'm assuming it'll get a fix soon, which is nice because I would like to get 100% on the game. Now I'm moving on to minor bugs. First is the Poison Ivy gear set. Um, it does not work. Uh, when you complete the set, the infamous set for Poison Ivy, it does not do anything at all. Um, not really sure why that is but it doesn't work as intended and in other items and other gear set items not necessarily saying or claiming to do what exactly they're supposed to do and here's another one of the next minor bug are destroyers being unable to be shield harvested um, if you've played higher mastery missions you'll know what I mean basically destroyers when they get the shield harvest prompt it doesn't pop up so you basically just die instantly and it can really kill a run especially in certain content um, so yeah obviously I assume this is just a minor issue um, next this is more of just a funny glitch it's not really a bug or anything it doesn't really affect the game but that's quantum boomerang um, when basically when boomerang uses his traversal attack 
it'll basically be glowing forever. Like what I said, not really, doesn't really affect anything. It's more just cool to look at and it's kind of funny, but I decided to put it on here. Um, now we have missions not tracking for raising hell. Um, when you complete a mission in Metropolis, there's a chance that the mission won't track or pop up on your, you know, completion list for raising hell. And next with the raising hell is enemies not spawning when you complete a raising hell tier list. This has only happened to me about twice. Um, I don't really know how frequent it is, but you know, it's just something to be known. Next is care package progression. Probably the most glitched thing in a game because you could spend hours killing those um, drones in the sky and you feel like your care package progression just doesn't move at all. This is at least how I feel. Um, and then also too, in mastery missions, specifically when you're playing with friends, enemies won't spawn at all so therefore you have to restart the mission entirely. And next we have Brainiac voice lines. Um, this isn't really... I assume it's obviously it's a glitch, but it's not like it doesn't affect gameplay or affect people in any way. But um, Brainiac will name off future DLC characters with various voice lines, specifically in high difficulty mastery versions. Um, level up prompt, specifically if you're over or max level for each character, um, you'll continuously get the level up prompt even though you just didn't level up. I'm not really sure why that is. Um, next though is grenades and other various loadout items getting locked. Um, there's quick fix fixes and workarounds around this, so that's why I have it at the bottom. And then lastly, in our minor bugs category, is duplicate characters in multiplayer sessions. You'll have two sharks or two dead shots and so on and so forth. And now we have, the, do they even know it's glitched? And in these, we only have two bugs in this category. One's technically not even a bug, but just thought I'd put it on here just so people would know. Um, and the first one is the audio logs not unlocking. So basically, when you hit certain chapter thresholds in the game, you're supposed to unlock audio logs. And for me at least, I have not unlocked any audio logs. And I would like, I'm interested to hear, you know, some of the audio logs and get an idea of what's going on in the game, but I just can't hear them. Specifically the ones when it says beat and complete chapter 6 or unlocked in chapter 6 and then other various stuff that you're supposed to unlock through incursion missions or chapters. They just haven't unlocked for me and I assume they haven't unlocked for other players. And then lastly is no anti-cheat. Now I know this isn't a big problem but for leaderboards it is. There are a ton of players that are abusing the system and cheating on the game and honestly I really don't even think Rock City knows this or maybe even cares. But, obviously, this is a minor, or this is a bugs and glitches video, not talking about the game's anti-cheat and cheating, or just rise and cheaters. Anyways, so, hope you guys enjoyed this video. These are all of the major and minor bugs in Suicide Squad Killed the Justice League, at least the ones I have found and have seen. If you guys have any other bugs, drop them down below, because you never know. Uh, Rock City Dev may watch this video and this could help him. Once again, I'm uploading this video to not make fun of Rock City. This is just so people who are playing the game know what's going on. And obviously, if a Rock City Dev is to watch this game to help them fix the game, because I want nothing but the best for this game and I want nothing but success. I know other people may not feel that way, but that's how I feel at least. Anyway, so this is Final Boss Way. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please consider liking and subscribing because it helps out a ton. And lastly, peace out.